Hello, sport fan. This is Stephen here with Sports Choice Plus. I'm bringing you a very special breakdown. I'm going to be covering the best possible space for Brian Burns. Before I get right into that, I want to make sure that you're subscribed to the YouTube channel so you can get all the updates and all the breakdowns. Without further ado, let's get right into the action. One of the most important pieces of this free agency is linebacker from the Carolina Panthers, who is now free agent, Brian Burns. Not only with his size, but his attacking style, the way he plays the game of football, the way that he approaches it at age 26, he can play edge rusher. He can also play linebacker. He has a number of things that he does well. That combination in itself has so many different opportunities and so many different places where he can fit in on an NFL roster. Looking at exactly what his skill set does, you have to ask yourself, which team can use him the best? And I think the, the number one team that comes to mind is matching him up with none other than the Detroit Lions. When I'm looking at Aiden Hutchinson, and I look at his motor on one side. I look at the way that he attacks and he attacks the run and he attacks the defense. I look at the other side and I say, hmm, you could possibly throw Brian Burns over there, do a little bit of time putting his hand in the dirt, a little bit of time at linebacker, and do what Khalil Mack did. At one point in time, Khalil Mack played both linebacker and defensive end and became all pro. At 26 years of age, I believe the Detroit Lions can use some of that money they have in free agency to bring Brian Burns there and improve that defense. Not only does that improve the pass rush, not only does that improve the run as far as defense against the run, but that allows you to have two monsters that you have to now account for. Offenses now have to scheme for that. You have to either bring in another tight end, you have to bring in another running back, you have to bring in somebody to chip block something. You can't just have one side overloaded and put your protection there when you're playing the Detroit Lions. With the way that he played in Carolina, I don't feel like he got his just due. I feel like Brian Burns outperformed a lot, and because the defense was so good at times, he didn't get his just due. He didn't get his proper praise and or flowers. A way to do that is playing on a team where you have multiple guys that can get to the quarterback. What does he do well? He puts his hand in the dirt. He plays well with good leverage. He plays good as far as moving with his defensive moves, getting offensive linemen out the way. And he also crashes down and attacks the quarterback with great fervor. I think Brian Burns is not only one of the top 10 prospects in this free agency class, but if he gets away from Carolina, there's going to be a large amount of suitors that are at his front door with a Brinks truck. I think that his best fit is playing indoors with the Detroit Lions and helping that young defense get even better to go along with that great offense that they have. You get yourself another DN, you get yourself a corner, you get yourself a safety here or there, and you potentially have a Super Bowl winning roster. So for me, Brian Burns, his best fit is the Detroit Lions. You get in the comment section, folks, tell me what you think. You feel like I'm right, you feel like I'm wrong. Tell me what you think his potential fit is as well. Definitely check out Sports Choice Plus for all the breakdowns. See us in the archive, and we'll see you in the next one.